So, Ted, yesterday at work, I totally talked you up to that super hot makeup girl, Liz. Oh, yeah? Mm -hmm. What would you say? Oh, you know how funny you are. Guilty. Handsome. Who, me? Incredible lover. <laughs> really? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I was all like, he knows a woman's body better than she knows her own. Endless waves of pleasure just cresting and breaking for hours and hours, blah, blah, blah. Orgasms so intense, you just black out. All that stuff. Robin, how can I possibly live up to that review? What? You know what you're doing down there. Oh, Teddy Westside can bring it. We know this. <laughs> but that is not the point. I mean, you, you broke the first rule of setting people up. Undersell. It's like if someone's never seen The Karate Kid, you don't say, it's the greatest movie ever. You say, uh, it's pretty good. And then they see it, it blows their freaking mind. Because Cobra Kai Sensei's all like, sweep the leg. And Daniel Sun's all like, Maybe I did oversell you a bit. Thank you guys so much for helping us out with this stuff. Oh, it gives us a rare insight into the makings of Barney Stinson. Mm -hmm. Like, look at this. Who was a cute little basketball player before he became the biggest pervert in the world? Mm -hmm. I love Pee Wee basketball. Well, until they kicked me off the team. I was so awesome, the coach asked me to quit because it wasn't fair to the other kids. That sounds plausible. Hey, it's true. Tell him, James. Oh, yeah, he had like a four-foot vertical leap. Huh. He would hit it from the outside, hit it from the inside. He sucked. Coach cut him from the team, and Mom fed him that story so he'd feel better. Oh, my God, look at this. My letter from the Postmaster General. I still can't believe he took the time to write this. Dear Barney. I sincerely apologize about losing all the invitations you sent out to your eighth birthday party. That's why none of your classmates showed up. Not because you threw up when they turned the lights off at the planetarium. No one even noticed that. Also, Janie Masterson's mother is a whore. Gin on her breath at 10 in the morning. She's got some nerve kicking us out of the carpool. Love, Postmaster General. <laughs> Thank you. Does your mom make stuff like that up a lot? Constantly. I, I, I mean, she put more effort into some lies than others. Mom, who's my dad? All the other kids at school know who their dad is. Who's mine? Oh, I don't know. That guy. Uh, you are? <laughs> Did she tell you that Bob Barker was your dad, too? No, no, no. I heard Flip Wilson, Bill Cosby, James Earl Jones, Meadowlark Lemon. <laughs> the list goes on. I still can't get a straight answer about who my real dad is, and Barney's no help. He still believes every lie that my mom told us growing up. Not me. I caught on early. Careful! Michael Jackson sent me this glove for my 10th... Damn. 